This video was made possible by the EA Creator Network. So I just wanted to quickly let you guys know you can still use my code Fantasia over on the EA app when you're at checkout. You can use it for any of the Sims packs and this does include kits. If you do decide to use my code, I just want to say thank you so freaking much. Seriously, it does help support me and my channel. And with that said, let's just go ahead and get right into the video. Hey everyone, it's Fantasia. So today we're going to be going over both of the new kits, the Riviera Retreat Kit and the Cozy Bistro Kit. First, I'm just going to be placing down all the items so you guys have an idea of what you get, even though I feel like a lot of you guys already know everything was leaked ahead of time, but I feel like it is different to see in your own game. So this is the stuff that comes with the Riviera Retreat Kit, all of this stuff here. And then this is the stuff with the Cozy Bistro Kit. Combined, this is how much stuff you get. Honestly, it's not a lot, but we're used to that with the kits. So before we get into it, it lets you our notification shout out and this one goes to gk the world riviera and bistro make me think of france i think this confirms we're getting a french world with the romance pack so this got me excited when i read it because i definitely feel like a lot of times they will release kits that kind of match what's coming out in that quarter or you know what i mean just we have more things that go together and stuff like that and yeah i really do feel like it confirms that so i have no doubt about it thank you so much for your comment and if you guys want a chance to be the comment of the day all you have to do is comment down below. So let's go ahead and start looking at the Riviera Retreat. So we have some dining chairs, which honestly are really nice. I like the texture on these. We're going to be looking at the color swatches too, but I love to just kind of place everything out first. Okay. So this is the kit that I was more excited about just because I feel like with it being, you know, the warmer months and everything like that, I just get more excited for this type of stuff and it makes me want to use it more. Honestly, yeah, I feel like I will definitely get use out of this in my sims backyards in different pool lots so oh those are nice curtains as well so we will look at everything closer up but just to kind of see everything laid out oh i like those rocks too okay you know kits really aren't my thing but oh okay i love these in backyards you know and you put all like the seating under there and then we actually get these little patio rocks which i'm gonna just put them there i think that would be really nice for a little backyard um this is a little small item this is just a pool light so I'm just going to place this here. That's a really nice pool light, honestly. And then we get this little light. So it's like a little candle. Okay. So there is all the items and it always seems like so little like that. <laughs> there should be a pre-made room too, which we will take a look at. But here are the color swatches. Honestly. Ooh, I like that one. Oh, and there's like a pastel pink one. Ooh, I like that too. Okay. I was going to say, I honestly just like the first swatch, but yeah, I really like this tone, but then I like all the ones that have that like beige tone in them. Yeah, like I even prefer this one over that one. Like that's really cute. Everything will just be pretty matchy matchy, but this does look quite a bit different because of the pillow and stuff. Cute, cute. And then we have this table here. Again, everything matches, but I will go ahead and put some different color swatches on. Like, you know, the black's nice too, but I really like the lighter tones for this because I feel like, you know, it's like a beachy type of thing. It just looks nice. <laughs> I don't know. This color tone just looks really nice with these pieces. So the little drink tray, this is a really cute drink tray i'm not gonna lie yeah like it is really nice look at that and this is also a really nice little fire pit i just like the way it's like this bowl shape you know and then we have this table with the umbrella these are my favorite type of tables to put in backyards that are like summery and then the new pool floaty this is actually nice as well like i don't know i just feel like these pieces are nice obviously i feel like i could have lived without it <laughs> um i just feel like it's not anything crazy special but it's actually nice pieces that I feel like won't just be forgotten about. The color tones make me just feel calm. I don't know what it is, but they really do that for me. So yeah, these are nice. I would even use these in like a bedroom. And then the rocks even have like the similar color tone. So that's nice. Of course, this one will have like the same thing. And then same with this. Oh, okay. This one, the shapes change, which is nice if you're decorating a backyard. This is really pretty. I feel like this would look really peaceful in like, honestly, not even just a backyard. Obviously this stuff would look really nice on kind of like a honeymoon lot, which here's hoping we get honeymoons with the new pack coming. Ooh. Oh, oh, I really like that. Like, look how romantic that looks. Oh, <gasps> Oh my god, cute. <laughs> but I really like this one too. But this, 
the vibes with that one. Ooh, I love it. Okay, so we do get the pre-made room as always. So we're gonna go ahead and pull this out. There is some different color swatches here. I feel like this one just looks so romantic. And you know, with this being the season of love for The Sims, I think I'm gonna place this one down. Yeah, it comes together very beautifully. I just think everything's gorgeous, you know? We do, do we? Okay, yes, I was gonna say, do we? I'm just gonna go ahead and place some walls or just one long wall so we can look at the couple wallpapers. So we get this one here and then we get this one here and it does come in some different color swatches. Everything again, very matchy. Nothing here, no new windows, I don't believe so. And then yeah, we do get the new archway. Yeah, it doesn't look like there is anything. Okay, we do get one flooring with again, very cohesive swatching. So I'm inserting this clip here. I think this happens again later in the video, but there is actually new pool trims. So of course this is with the Riviera Retreat Kit and these pool trims are really, really nice. I discovered it because I was going ahead and building a pool. I just thought it would look really nice here to take some pictures and I was like, oh my God, this is actually really pretty. So of course it comes in some different swatches, but yeah, we get two of those. So I just wanted to let you guys know that because I do think this is actually something a lot of people care about. New pool trims are super necessary for a lot of different builds. That might sound silly, but I feel like it's like, look how nicely that pulls this together. I just think that looks so pretty. And then of course we do get the new pool ladder. So, and then I did show you guys this though, the little pool light, which I'm going to go ahead and just place in. I love the new pool ladder too. Another cool thing before we switch back to the original clip is these rocks look really really cool when you put them by a pool there's water that will come down and so yeah this kit for me personally just keeps on getting better I just think this would look absolutely gorgeous at like a honeymoon lot or something like that I don't know everything coming together like this is just so pretty I really just like the idea of using this pre-made room and then adding a pool like this. I don't know, these rocks are just doing it for me. And yeah, I think that's it. I don't know if I miss anything, but I'm kind of clicking around and not seeing anything else. So now let's do the next kit. Cozy Bistro, we're gonna go in the same type of order. I feel like this lot has plenty of space, so we'll just kind of start placing things over here. So this one, I mean, the vibe's similar, but different. I feel like they, I don't know. I feel like this stuff will look good in the world we're gonna get, and I haven't even seen the world world yet. I just feel like it's gonna work, you know? Yeah, I definitely think they're doing something here. Absolutely. You know, I think people who, like from a business standpoint, I feel like their mindset is like the people who don't purchase these kits might want them when the pack comes out because I just feel like it's gonna match so well. I could be wrong, but it really seems like these things are gonna go amazingly with the new world we're getting. So yeah, I'm gonna place this little alcohol bottles up here and this over here. And then of course we will take a look up close. So this kit would be kind of useless for me if you know, you don't have packs that allow you to actually make a functioning cafe. I even would want cats and dogs for like more of an experience with making wine for our Sims. You know what I mean? We can't really put this anywhere. I'm going to have to just kind of grab something. I mean, move objects is on and all, but it doesn't want to let me. So we're just going to go ahead and grab something. This is nice. I will say this looks like CC. It really does look like a, it literally looks like a custom content set that I have. I don't know which one, but it really, really does. I'm going to actually start with the swatches for this. Oh yeah. Even the swatches are reminding me of that coffee maker. That's a super nice coffee maker. I will say. So the signs, I believe. Yes. Okay. So this will change based on the color. So you kind of get like multiple things going on there. And then I think this one too. Yeah. For some reason, some of these items also remind me of Vampire Diaries and I don't know why. Not that they look like vampire stuff. Not at all. It just looks like some pieces, like the furniture, the style of it. I feel like I would see it in the Vampire Diary show, you know, if they're like at this bistro or something. Does anyone else get that energy? I don't know what it is, but it's just making me think of that. I love this, I will say. But yeah, this is my least favorite kit of the two. But I mean, not that I wouldn't use these pieces. I think I would more so use it if I was just grabbing like a bistro off the gallery. But yeah, I really would only want this kit if I already had like dino get together horse ranch and we could have the whole shebang <laughs> like you know they could get coffee here i mean yeah it comes with a coffee maker so that you know the idea is if you even if you just have base game you can just come and get your own coffee and you can go to the bar with base game get a drink come sit down 
But I don't know. That's not giving for me. Like, <laughs> I don't know. When I hear Cozy Bistro, I want the Cozy Bistro experience. Like, I want to set this as a cafe. I want to use these items and set the lot as a cafe. And I want to come here and have my Sims get served coffee, like fancy coffees, lattes, Americanos, all that. <laughs> and then sit down and drink those with their significant other or their friends and yeah like be able to get actual wine you know from horse ranch that's just how i would want to use this kit i feel like it pairs well if you have a lot of the packs ooh, i do like the color swatches for that okay cute this is really cute you know this looks like it would be perfect to put because of the book there it would be perfect to put at the front of a fancy lot or something like that i don't know like i would even use that at a wedding and then we have the lamp here so this is what that looks like and then you can't actually change that but see seeing this here i'm just like okay i want there to be actual wine being served and then you know if you are on pc and you're using something like base mental mod your sims will actually get tipsy and stuff <laughs> This, I just like the realism. So yeah, we have that light there and then this here. Yeah, I don't know. The other kit definitely gets me way more excited, but oh, I do like that. Yeah, that's cute as heck. I really like the swatches. And then we get this little curtain. Oh, that's actually cute. I would put that like over a bathroom window, honestly. And then this mirror is really cute, I will say. I feel like you could get multiple uses out of this mirror. Like how adorable is that? I do really like that. And then we get this picture, yep, which I'm, which I'm sure changes. I like that one. So now let's go ahead and grab the room for this one, your neighborhood bistro. I'm still just, I want to go for the romance vibes. <laughs> it just makes sense. Okay, yeah, see, cute. But imagine you have the other packs and this is like actually, you could add in like the cafe little thing. That would be so cute. But yeah, you could definitely use this just with base game. Like I'm not saying you can't. I think it's more, for me, it just seems so much more purposeful if you have the other packs. But if you are someone with just base game, this experience might be great for you. It might help you have more fun with base game. I feel like, you know, it's pretty normal for you to feel different once you own more packs because then you're like, okay, like this experience is completely different than just base game. But if you just have base game, it's not something that you feel like you may need to use this, right? So yeah, I do think this kit comes together beautifully. I think the items look really, really good together. But still, as I thought from the beginning this is still my favorite kit and I would definitely purchase this one over that one for many reasons. I also think I will just get more use out of this whether it's on my home lot or like a public pool lot and then I think even when the romance pack does come out I'll get more use out of this as well. Okay I'm throwing this clip in really quick. I don't know if it's a weird jump or anything like that but I was like oh my goodness I did not go over the wallpaper and stuff for the bistro kit so I just wanted to show you guys that. So this is what this wallpaper looks like honestly really nice i do enjoy the wallpaper and then the doors we actually get this beautiful bistro door which i know you guys saw in the little room but seeing them standalone these are really nice doors too <laughs> like i will say i feel like the doors and the wallpaper is even nicer than some of the items we get yeah i don't know they're just really really nice yeah i think they were really well done and we do get this window here and i think think that is it but again if i missed anything i apologize oh yeah this floor so here's the flooring that we also already saw but here it is on its own and yeah there's lots of different color swatches but yeah how do you guys feel i'm honestly so curious comment down below which kit is your favorite will you be purchasing any have you purchased them i want to know down below and with that said i hope you all enjoyed i hope you guys are having an amazing day and i'll see you all in my next video bye guys then